100,000 views. I already explained how I use storytelling to get more retention. Now it's if you observe his voice closely, you'll notice that it doesn't sound like a regular generated AI voice. Instead, there is something different about it. His voice is unique, that's why he didn't face any monetization issues, and it sounds ultra-realistic. He obviously achieved that by editing it. And most importantly, his voice has emotions, something that AI typically lacks. So how to actually generate AI voice like his? Well, it's very easy. Just give me three minutes of your life and I'll teach you step by step how to do it. The first step is to get a unique AI voice. To generate a unique AI voice, you need to create a custom voice. Head over to 11 Labs and generate a custom voice from the Voice Lab tab. You can copy the settings. These are the same settings he used to create his voice. As for the accent strength, set it between 60 and 65. In the first few tries, you might not get the results you are looking for, so keep trying until you get your dream voice. After this, add your script here and select the recently generated voice. But before you click generate, go to the settings and make some changes. Increase stability, similarity, and style exaggeration a little bit, or just try what suits your custom voice tone best. After this, click generate speech. The first step is done. Now we have a unique AI voice like Isaac's, but this voice doesn't sound entirely human. Even though they claim it to be realistic, it will still sound a little robotic. So we have to edit it if we want results like Isaac's. To edit, import your audio file into this application and then start adding effects. First, add change tempo between plus six to eight, according to your voice. You can click play to check its effect on the voice. Now your voice is then, ready. Then click change speed and increase the speed between plus five to seven. Next, come to the equalizer amplifier. These three will add treble, and these three will add bass to your voice, so adjust according to your requirements, or you can just copy mine. Click apply, and then click compressor. Keep the threshold between minus 20 to 25, then click apply. Finally, your voice is ready! But there is something very important your voice still lacks. Emotions. So how to add emotions in AI voices? Well, it is simple. Just think about how Isaac does it. What is it that adds emotions to his voice in videos? It's not his editing even though his editing is a masterpiece. And also, it's not the background music that he changes again and again. Even though all of these factors matter, there is still something very important that you are ignoring, and that is his engaging scripts. This is also the secret of his success on YouTube, even though he uses an AI voice. So if you want to add emotions, focus on creating engaging scripts because they will help you connect with your viewers. Consider the AI voice as a medium between you and your viewers, and through scripting, you're talking to them. That's it. However, if you want AI to help you with this, do the following when you add your scripts on 11 labs. Add commas, full stops, exclamatory signs, and question marks to make the AI voice take pauses and exaggerate words and sentences as required. If you follow all of my key points, you'll be able to create a unique, ultra-realistic, human-like AI voice like Isaac that is 100% monetizable. It will work as long as your content is original. Okay, that's it for today's video. Do let me know your feedback. Like this video if you think it helped you even a tiny bit. This motivates me to create more. Best of luck to all of you on your YouTube journey.